everyone. So today I've got something really nice to show you. I've got this phone from Juning. So your phone comes wrapped in this plastic bubble wrap to keep it safe in shipping. And you get so many free things with this phone. They send you a screen protector. I absolutely love this case that they send. Also included in the box is a nice three foot charger. The charger is a nice quality and the wall outlet to charge your phone. And they also give you this really nice pair of headphones. The wire on it is the flat type and it also has where you can answer phone calls and a microphone. Also included is a well-written set of instructions showing you all about how to use the phone. There's plenty of information here on the phone and it has another side as well. Now this phone actually measures five and three quarter inches by three inches and a very slim quarter inch. And the phone is very lightweight. So it's really the perfect size. It will fit in the back pocket of your jeans or in your purse very easily. The edges almost seem to be made out of a metal or something. The phone feels very good and very high quality to me. So I really like the way this phone looks. It's very sleek and sophisticated looking. And it looks almost exactly the same as the Galaxy S5 that I have. And I'll be comparing those two side by side later in the video. So its function buttons are located on the side here. This is the volume up down. This is your power. And they're located towards the top of the side here in a very convenient location. So your other two buttons are down here at the bottom. They're built into the screen. You have your back button and your settings button. And your home button is a capsule shaped button here at the bottom. There is a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack here. And your charging port is not in the traditional location. It is located up here at the top of the phone. I haven't found this to be a problem at all and actually quite convenient. So when you're charging it, your cord is hanging off the top instead of off of the bottom where it usually is. So it kind of keeps the cord more out of the way and going straight towards your outlet. And down on the bottom here is your speaker. It's very nice. Now I absolutely love the case that they send you free with the phone. It goes on very easily and it seems like it really protects the corners of your phone. Covers the entire corner and even wraps around the top. So if you take your back cover off, this gives you access to a 2800 mAh removable battery. Also back here you have a dual SIM. So you will be able to use two different carriers if you would like. And this is where your micro SD card will go which you'll most likely need to keep this phone working at its best. Now when you get the phone, there will be this very small yellow sticker covering the ports of the battery here and you need to make sure you remove this or your phone will not be able to charge and turn on. To turn the phone on, you're going to press and hold this button here and it shows the welcome screen as it's loading. So I can't even begin to tell you how impressed I've actually been with this phone. The screen on it looks amazing. It's a very nice size. It just looks really good. So I actually love the fact that you can actually have a really nice phone without having to pay hundreds of dollars to go through the phone company. So the battery in this phone is not bad. I actually did a test to see how long it would actually take for the battery to run down to dead, streaming full screen video over Wi-Fi with this screen brightness set to max, and the phone actually made it three hours and 35 minutes. I also did this with my Galaxy S5 that's about a year old, and it made it four hours and 37 minutes. So that's actually not bad. You should have no problem getting through a full day of use with this phone. I have been super impressed with the quality of the screen here. It's a five inch QHD, which means quad high definition. 
that has a very high pixel rich display. The colors are very bright and detailed and it actually looks quite amazing. So let's play a video. So while we're getting to the video, I just wanna show you how quickly this screen loads up everything. So it's very quick to load things. We'll do SpongeBob. So you can see the screen looks very nice. The speakers don't sound the best, but they're good enough. So even though you're not paying a lot for this phone, you still get a lot of extra things that you can do with this phone. For example, it even has a built-in accelerometer. So let's go to the game here. So you play the game by moving to the left or right. And there's all kinds of games you can do this with, like racing games. This is just one that I have. But it's really fun. So you just move it left or right and back and forth to play the game, it's pretty cool. So another really cool add-on this phone has is an FM radio. So you just go to the radio and it will tell you to plug your headphones in. So you plug your headphones in up here and you can listen to radio. How cool is that? You pick your station and you can auto search stations. This gets very good reception. You actually get a lot of channels. And you can also hook like a speaker up to this as well. So this phone also has a very nice camera. The pictures it takes are okay. Here's a few that I took. So that's okay. Not the greatest quality, but okay. Very bright colors, very good detail. So this camera is a, has a lot of great editing tools to it. You can change the colors. You can put borders around your pictures. So you also have a video camera, which you can snap pictures while you're videoing, which is really cool. So you also have quite a few different settings here. You have your Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, which connects immediately. You can tether from this phone, which is really cool. So if you wanna get internet onto a laptop, you can get it from your phone. So you also have this air gesture. So you'll swipe your phone over the top here and that can control all of these different things, whichever you choose. So you just swipe your hand over the top and it will change it. You can also choose to set a password, a swipe, pick a pattern to keep your phone secure from other people getting into it that you don't want. You can schedule the power to go on and off at a certain time every day. Another pretty cool thing this phone has is this smart wake feature. So you can choose to set these to whatever you would like. So for example, you can draw a C on the screen to wake the camera up. So when the phone is off like this, you just draw a C motion on the screen and it will automatically bring up your camera. That is here under the accessibility options, smart wake. So draw an O to bring up the calendar. Pretty cool. I also wanted to show you to get to the open apps on your phone, press and hold this button and it will bring up everything that you've had on your screen. And closing these out helps keep your phone running more smooth. So check this out. This is the Galaxy S5. This is the Juning phone. This costs about $600 and this costs about 50. They look amazingly the same. They're exactly the same size. I think the Juning phone might be even a bit thinner than the Galaxy S5. Amazing. So these phones are about just as fast as each other. So let's open Google Maps here. They load just about the same. So let's open Google Chrome. So let's go here. So you can see it's not far behind, they're not far behind each other at all. Tell you the truth, I do not see much difference in these two phones at all. 
the Galaxy might have a better speaker than the Juning, and it might pick up better Wi-Fi than the Juning, and the camera is probably a little better as well, but you can barely tell the camera's better. So again, I have been very impressed with this phone. It is worth the $50 to $60 they are charging for it, for sure. It has everything you're gonna need in a phone and more. This phone is going to be useful in almost every aspect of your life. It has a camera, a calendar, a schedule, you know, everything you could possibly need. I really hope that you all have enjoyed hearing everything I've learned about this phone, and I hope all of this information has been helpful in helping you make your decision. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.